Hey, how you doing? Oh, here at the Harley dealership just picked up a liter of oil. Best laid plans. You know what they say about the best laid plans? <laughs> Subject to change, right? Yeah, and that's all right. Uh, upcoming trip, I got three weeks to go now before I hit the road and head south. I was gonna go through Phoenix and uh, visit a brother down there, uh, but it turns out he's not gonna be available that weekend. So, uh, we're gonna just head straight down to Vegas. Um, Google Maps says it's like 21 hours from here. I'm not in a rush. I'm gonna stop and smell the roses all the way down. So, you know, I don't care if it takes me four days, just ride five hours a day, stop here and there. Um, one thing I am gonna do though, on the way down is probably run Death Valley. And I don't know if I'm just going to stay on the main road and go past the outskirts of it um, or veer off and like take the smaller highway right through the middle. That's something I'll have to figure out. Uh, but anyway, the bike, we got it all checked out. I greased the uh, steering column this morning. I usually do that about three times a year. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's overkill, you know, but it's got a grease nipple on it. So I grease it make sure the grease comes out the top bearing right so because uh, eventually the grease gravity is going to pull it all down to the bottom so make sure there's lots coming out the top and we're good to go there and uh, i just talked to the one guy one guy inside he's the only guy that's got experience riding through a desert he rode through the mojave and shit like that so he was giving me some tips and he's like, when are you going? I said, three weeks. He said, holy fuck, it's going to be hot. <laughs> I said, yeah. Like, I don't care about myself, okay? I'm just worried about the bike. Like, tips or tricks. And uh, he's basically saying, like, don't ride through there in the daytime, especially middle of the day. So we'll see what happens. Um, I'm going to be tenting it. Going down, just sleeping wherever. And I figure probably... The night before I run through Death Valley, I'll probably get a hotel room that night and maybe leave like just at the crack of dawn and uh, try and get through there. I don't know, it's not, I don't think it's that long going through, really. What, three hours or I don't know. I haven't really checked that out, but uh, try and get through there before noon hour be out of it um, either that or I'll head down through in the evening and then uh, yeah I don't know we'll see we'll kind of play that by ear but anyway that's what's going on and right now it finally warmed up again today we had a couple hot days a week ago when I did the last video I think there was a couple days there that were hot and sunny and that was like on a Friday, Saturday and then all of a sudden Sunday, man, it was rain and cold and the furnace is coming on in the house and it's like, holy shit, you know, this is the 1st of July, right? So anyway, we're into the second weekend of July here now. So finally, maybe it's starting to warm up. I don't know, man this uh, northwest coast it's sometimes it just sucks <laughs> anyway that's the plans we'll see what happens in three weeks if i change the route but planning on uh, running down to portland cutting across through the mountains death valley down into vegas spend a week or so there and then uh, come back up through salt lake city and back up into seattle and then back up into canada all right, take care, be safe.